Okay, Migovan and everyone, welcome to a brand new let's play. I'm playing with some mods, um, mostly graphical mods. I just want to enhance the immersive experience, not that. Not the game. Not that the game had bad graphics, you know, in the past. Uh, quite good, um, you know, back then, 2006 was it. Uh, even though the faces looked kind of funny and they had potato heads. In fact, I have one where it changes the shape of the heads to uh, to not be potato. Uh, and I have something called uh, O O C O something. It's uh, the uh, the, the character overhaul uh, thing. I forgot what it was called, but it's a very popular one, uh, version 2. So it will make all the heads look better. Uh, and of course I have the unofficial patch. Uh, and um, I think there were two other mods that were required and I needed the uh, script extender, but the script extender I guess works differently here than it does for uh, or is um, maybe more stable uh, than uh, um, uh, the, the Skyrim script extender which I had problems with before in the past which is why I don't use that uh, for Skyrim I think all of this looks like it's okay kind of loud I think difficulty this is all good um, I think I just want to save on travel video seems to be okay I do not know how taxing all of this would be, but what are detail? Hi, all of this looks good. Okay, that's fine. I mean, it's only running like temperature of 60, 60 degrees. Okay, I will start a new game. I know that there's uh, Oblivion Remastered coming out sometime in the future there was like a leak maybe like a year or two ago that it was in the works so I don't know how far along they've gotten also I know there's uh, a project by um, fans called uh, Sky Oblivion so I will try out both when they come out so in a way uh, you know there's kind of like three versions I guess I'm playing um, a lightly uh, modded vanilla version with you know the patches and uh, you know graphical uh, enhancements and uh, DLC expansion stuff like that uh, and then the Sky Oblivion and the uh, Oblivion remaster but let's go ahead and try this it is March 3rd 2024 I was born 87 years and it ago. got loud for 65 years I've ruled as Tamriel's Emperor but for all these years, I've never been the ruler of my own dreams. I have seen the gates of oblivion, beyond which no waking eye may see. Behold, in darkness, a doom sweeps the land.
This is the 27th of last seed, the year of Akatosh 433. These are the closing days of the third era and the final hours of my life. of magic, right? Hmm. Nothing but a bunch of stuck-ups. Go ahead. Try your magic in here. Let's see you make those bars disappear. No. Yeah, the graphics What's look the matter? Not really so good. You're not leaving this prison till they throw your body in the lake. Oh, that's right. You're going to die in here, Breton. You're... Hey, you hear that? The guards are coming. For you. <laughs> I know it. My job right now is to get you to safety. What's this prisoner doing here? This cell is supposed to be off limits. As usual, mix up with the watch. I. Never mind. Get that gate open. Stand back, prisoner. We won't hesitate to kill you if you get in our way. You, prisoner, stand aside. Over by the window. Stay out of the way and you won't get hurt. No sound. Stay put, prisoner. Good. Let's go. We're not yeah, out of the faces yet. are much, you, much better. I've seen you. Yeah. Let me see your face. Yeah, much better. You are the one from my dreams. Then the stars were right. And this is the day. Gods give me strength. What goes on here? Assassins attack my sons, and I am next. My blades are leading me out of the city along a secret escape route. By chance, the entrance to that escape route leads through your cell. There must be some mistake. I, I should not be in here. Why am I in here? Perhaps the gods have placed you here so that we may meet. As for what you have done, it does not matter. That is not what you will be remembered for. You know this how, I wonder? Uh, who might you be? I am your emperor, Uriel Septim. By the grace of the gods, I serve Tamriel as her ruler. You are a citizen of Tamriel. And you, too, shall serve her in your own way. I'd rather make my own... I'd rather pave my own way. So do we all. But what path can be avoided whose end is fixed by the almighty gods? Please, sire, we must keep moving. The armor looks... I thought I read that There's it didn't do armor, but no it seems like it does some of it to a certain extent. It's really good. Okay, um... Let me see... Yeah, F5, yeah. Wait a minute. Okay. 
interesting. Okay. It's like I scroll in here and um, it scrolls in my uh, uh, OBS, but it's okay, it's not interfering with the recording. Take a look at my spells. Fix follower. Double face bug for one second on touch. Oh, okay. spells again. Oh, see to cast. Okay. And ready weapon, so right. Protect the Emperor. Protect the Emperor. Down. Won't be the first to hunt. Underestimate the blade. I'll take point. Let's move. You stay here, prisoner. Since I'm a mage, or going to be, I'll just take these to sell.
there's a coin in one of these, like over here, some coins here. game was much more forgiving on stamina, whereas in Morrowind, if my stamina was down, my spell would fail and I would miss more. That uh, mechanic was great for Morrowind, but you know I can see why they made that less important for something like this. For, for Morrowind, it, it works great. That's what I love about uh, <clears throat> these Elder Scrolls games is that each uh, evolution, you know, iteration of the game, sure they took things away and um, changed the mechanics, but it it worked as a whole, you know, with uh, what the game was. Like all the changes that were made from, let's say, from Daggerfall to Morwind worked for Morwind. You know, and all the changes from Morrowind to Oblivion worked for Oblivion. And same for, uh, for Skyrim. And I know that there's a gem down here. Ruby, here it is. Uh, I'd, I'd say at this point Skyrim is the game, the Elder Scrolls game that I played the most of, but before Skyrim, uh, it was, um, I'm thinking, between uh, Daggerfall and Oblivion. It might be a toss-up between those two. Daggerfall may still come out the winner, but uh, Oblivion would uh, make a close third, almost the same, you know, equal, equal time spent with uh, Oblivion as I did with uh, Daggerfall. Oh, it's a complete outfit. Okay. rat on the, uh, I don't know what you call that, uh, the spit, is it called? The spit? Okay. I 
Once I get out of here, I think I'll take a break. supposed to run across yeah this trip wire and it was gonna kill that goblin I forgot about that was not thinking I do remember this style I will go with that being a mage right Drop it again. I forgot how to fucking drop. Oh shit.
done. Okay. Let's shift. There we are. Oh man, yeah, this is going on longer than I thought. They cannot understand why I trust you. They've not seen what I've seen. How can I explain? Listen, you know the Nine, how they guide our fates with an invisible hand. I know of them. The Nine Guilds and uh, protect us, or the Nine Guide and uh, protect us. I've served the Nine all my days, and I chart my course by the cycles of the heavens. The skies are marked I've with numberless sparks, being a each mage. a fire, and every one a sign. I know these stars well, and I wonder which sign marked your birth. Well, that's simple. I am marked by the sign of the mage. The signs I read show the end of my path. My death, a necessary end, will come when it will come. Your death? What of me? Your stars are not mine. Today the mage shall light your way on the paths of glory. You have seen my fate. My dreams grant me no opinions of success. Their compass ventures not beyond the doors of death. But in your face, I behold the sun's companion. The dawn of Akatosh's bright glory this is may Patrick vanish Stewart. the coming darkness. Sir Patrick Stewart, by the way, in with case such you didn't hope, already know. And with the promise of your aid, my heart must be satisfied. But we have other great voice act other actors and... And because of this, great voice actors, you know, people like Sean Bean, I believe he plays Martin. I think Linda Carter is a voice in here. Aren't you afraid to die? No trophies of my triumphs precede me, but I have lived well, and my ghost shall rest easy. Men are but flesh and blood, 
They know their doom, but not the hour. In this, I am blessed to see the hour of my death. To face my apportioned fate, then fall. So, where to? I go to my grave. A tongue shriller than all the music calls me. You shall follow me yet for a while. Then we must part. I have not known thee very long, but I shall miss thee. You may as well make yourself oh. useful here. Carry this torch and stick close. Very well. Stick close and let us do our job. Yeah, these faces are great. Not much farther. Take a look. Looks clear. Come on. We're almost through to the sewers. Side. A trap! What about that side passage back there? Where's the trap? Let's go! They're behind us! Wait here, sire. Wait here with the Emperor. Guard him with you your life. You thought we'd go for Die, the Emperor! You scum! Can go no further. You alone must Please stand tell me against this the now prince into middle of destruction combat. and his Please. mortal servants. He must not have the amulet of kings. Take the amulet. Give it to Joffrey. He alone knows where to find my last son. Find him and close shut the jaws of oblivion. Yes, my emperor. I shall try my best. What? Just 
issues already. We failed. I failed. The blades are sworn to protect the Emperor. Now he and all his heirs are dead. The amulet. Where's the amulet of kings? It wasn't on the Emperor's body. He gave me this. Strange. He saw something in you. Trusted you. They say it's the dragon blood that flows through the veins of every septum. They see more than lesser men. The amulet of kings is a sacred symbol of the Empire. Most people think of the red dragon crown, but that's just the wrinkles jewelry. around his eyes. It's the amulet has power. Only a true detailed. heir of the blood can wear it, they say. Compared to before. He must have given Originally, it to you for a reason. Right? Did he say why? He told me to take it to Joffrey. Joffrey? He said that? Why? There is yet another heir. Nothing I ever heard about. But Joffrey would be the one to know. He's the Grand Master of my order. Although you may not think so to meet him, he lives quietly as a monk at Wainan Priory, near the city of Coral. I'll need directions. First, you need to get out of here. Through that door must be the entrance to the sewers, past the locked gate. That's where we were heading. It's a secret way out of the Imperial City. Or it was supposed to be secret. Here, you'll need this key for the Apparently last door not. to the sewers. That mythic dawn knew how to get through. Okay, the sewers. There are rats and goblins down there. But from what I've seen of you, I'm guessing you're experienced enough to handle them. Am I right? Uh, you now must choose your class. The major skills of your class will start higher than your other skills. You will increase your level by raising these major skills. Very similar to uh, Morrowind, but slightly different. Okay, what did he guess I was? A spell sword. Pretty close. Um, hmm. Yes. Huh. That's pretty close. Except I do not use armor, so... Okay, uh... How do I want to this out I can go for a more uh, slower um, rate of leveling uh, and pick combat but still use more of the, the magics right but this will also help my uh, um, you know my melee skills you know get up there you know to keep pace with my magic let me see how this looks. And yet I will pick... God, skills up. Regenerate Magicka. Those two. And the seven I will pick are... Blade. Conjuration one, two, three, four. that 
combat. Intelligence and willpower. Alteration, blade. Conjuration, destruction. Illusion, mysticism, and restoration. And the thing is, you know, the only skill that's going to utilize the combat specialization is the blade. It's only going to make that go up faster. You know, and my other skills, although I'll be using them more frequently, it will level me up slowly, you know. But because, you know, it, it will make up for the slow rate of, uh, of you know, leveling <clears throat> by the frequency of use. And the blade, you know, I, you know, maybe at the beginning I might be using it a bit more, but I think as time goes by I won't be using it as much. Um, you know, it will be able to keep pace with everything else. So that is my strategy. Let's do it. Really? I would never have guessed. Still, I don't think you'll have any trouble with rats and goblins. Yep. Okay. After the sewers. You must get the amulet to Joffrey. Take no chances, but proceed to Wayne and Priory immediately. Got it? Yes. Understood. Good. The Emperor's trust was well placed. And you? What will you do? I'll stay here to guard the Emperor's body and make sure no one follows you. You'd better get moving. Guard the Emperor's body? His corpse? By the He's way, thanks for recovering Captain Renault's sword. Oh yeah, yeah. I'll see Kick that it. it is given a place of honor in the halls of the Blades. And the other guy too, Glenroy, I think his name. Uh, Dunbarrow Cove. Centuries ago, a great battle took place in. No, wasn't there a mod that, or maybe that was for Skyrim? That might have been for Skyrim, where it didn't just pop up you know out of nowhere it would just subtly make its way into your quest log so it just feels uh you know more organic centuries ago a great battle took place in anvil bay in the battle the legendary pirate toradon ap dougal the captain of the infamous black flag was defeated by the first count of anvil rumors have been circulating of a hidden underground cavern beneath castle anvil if the rumors are to be believed, then the final resting place of Captain Dougal and his ship have been uncovered. I should investigate these rumors as soon as possible. Uh, I will not read all of these yet because, yeah. And then Horse Armor, I've discovered a notice from Snuck Grabura of Chestnut Handy Stables. She is offering to outfit a horse with armor at no charge to anyone who presents her with a note like the one I found, like a voucher, right? Should bring my horse to her and take advantage of this offer. Yeah. Okay, okay. Let's save it. Yep. And then another pop up. Yep. I oh, will just read that later. All the pop ups, yeah, are going to come up like crazy. Now, this one's pertinent to me. According to a deed that's been delivered to me, I've inherited it, been delivered to me down in here. I've inherited a property called Fuscrag Fus Spire from a long lost relative. I've marked its location on my map. Uh, at the next opportunity, I should make my way out there and inspect my new acquisition. Battle horn. I may get that battle horn. It keeps going. That's for like evil characters. But the battle horn is quite nice. I do like that castle.
there's a single coin in one of these little, I don't know what you call it, this drain. Here it is. I always get that one. Ah, these are quite heavy, but... Uh, here one that I think is just idle doing his like rat mannerisms oh shit and I think this is the one friendly rat right I didn't have to kill it but well it's okay okay I'm going to, I just forgot about that, you know, last minute. All right, I'm going to end it here. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you on the next adventures.